Lorenzen Wright's mother has been coming to his grave since he died back in 2010, but for the first time in a long time, she felt a sense of peace about being out there. Couldn't stop. He leaving today too. Uh -uh, I could not stop today for the last 11 years. Deborah Marion has been on a race for justice for her son, Lorenz and Wright. He was telling me do not stop. Do not stop. So I said, I said, tell me the marathon came to a conclusion last week when a jury convicted Billy Ray Turner in his murder. Wright's ex-wife Shara is currently serving 30 years for facilitating the murder. Man couldn't do what, what God did. He did. He freed me. It's like, like my heart been covered in ice. Now some heat done got on and melted. Now I can go forward now. You know, quit thinking about bad stuff. Now cause something good done happen out of all this. I couldn't do no butt crap. Bringing us here to Calvary Cemetery, where Marion and her sister reunited with Lorenzen's son after nearly a decade apart. Oh, you're my baby. <laughs> Man, it's just a lot uh, to process, a lot going on. Uh, I don't know, I'm still processing it all and still trying to take it all in. Now at 22 years old, Shamar Wright is following in his dad's footsteps and playing college basketball in Illinois. Despite his mom being incarcerated and his dad no longer alive, he has not let his circumstances define him. It's always moving forward, always pushing forward to something that I'm pretty much focused on. Uh, you know, it's everything happens for a reason and I live by that. So I just keep on trying to uh, shine a light on you can make it through bad things. While the quest for justice has come to an end, Marion's inspiration for her race will always live on for the years to come. We got to get together, together, you know, because as a family, that's what he would have wanted. His kids with his mama, he know this is what we do. Reporting in Memphis, Jordan James, WREG. New Channel 3. Good to see them together there. And Jordan tells us next month, Marion is hosting an event with family and friends in celebration of the conviction and, of course, in memory of Lorenzen.